Hey guys, it's me Nora Fete and I'm going to be showing you guys an exact detailed tutorial of my hook step from the song Kusu Kusu, the Kusu Kusu hook step and I'm going to show you exactly how to execute the moves precisely to each detail. Alright guys, so now let's start. I'm going to show you guys step by step each movement how to start the Kusu Kusu hook step. Now, we have our legs together, alright, slightly bent because we're going to be descending as we do the belly roll, okay? So slightly bent like this, our hands, okay? They're not here, they're not here, they're actually right here. So you have your fingers soft like this, separated, and the hands are right here, okay? So this is to signify, you know, like, you don't got peace, you're restless, you're in love, you want to see your lover, okay? So it's the craziness, okay? Right here, okay? Oh, I'm, I'm just going crazy. This man driving me crazy. This is what it signifies, okay? Now, while we have our hands right here, we're going to do the belly roll. Now, the belly roll is literally right here. This is where it happens, the center of your stomach. Now, what I do is I bring my stomach in and I release out in, release out, in, release out. What the beauty of this move is, nothing else in your body shifts, nothing moves. Your chest stays where it's supposed to be, your shoulders don't move, your legs don't go here and there. You need to be static in yourself, okay? Dance within yourself, at peace, and the only thing that moves is the belly, okay? That is the impact of this move, okay? So while our hands are here on our head and we have our legs slightly bent, okay, don't forget, knees slightly bent, we're going to start doing the belly roll, okay, at kusu, 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 okay? So what we're doing is slow, slow, double, double, one more, okay? Now notice how I'm focusing in the center of my stomach and my pelvic is coming in, it's releasing out. In, releasing out. That is exactly how controlled your body needs to be. So this is what it's gonna look like, okay? Hands right here, okay? And we're gonna go one, two, double, double, one more, okay? And notice how I descend slowly as I do the move. Now by the time I finish that move, I'm pretty low, okay? I'm here. Now, I have to catch tera, right? So tera is this, all right? So what exactly is happening here? This move looks very graceful if it's done in control, okay? Complete control of your arms and your hips, which is doing an infinity, like almost like an infinity sign, right? So we're bent here. We're gonna take our right hip, so we'll focus just on this for now and then I'll tell you what to do with your arms. So right here, we're gonna take the right hip out and then we're gonna swirl back with the left and we're gonna position back to the center, okay? So I'm bent, the last kusu kusu has happened and now I'm gonna go tera, right? Now I'm back up and the left leg will be a little bit heightened. So lift it a little bit. So it all comes together. When I'm coming down, kusu, 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 tera. Okay? Now, a lot of people have been kicking their leg. That's not what we're doing. All that's happening is the hip gets into an infinity motion and you're back up. And while you're back up, your leg comes. Okay? So, tera. Now, what are we doing with our arms? If our arms are here for the last kusu, kusu, I take my right hand and I shift it like this. My left comes around and then I position it right here, okay? The right is here on my head. The left is positioned gracefully with a bent elbow right here, okay? So we're down. We're going to catch tera, okay? Now again, arms right here cross nicely back to position okay so let's try five six seven eight one two double double one more theta okay 
Now, when I come into center position, this hip is lifted in. Now, you'll notice the pelvic bone inside, okay? This is important for our next step, okay? For suku suku, right? So let's try again. Five, six, seven, eight. Kusu, 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 tera. Okay? Right, that was amazing. Okay, so let's move forward to suku, okay? Tera, suku, 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 suku. Okay, so what's happening here? Right when I come back after tera, I'm positioned like this because I've lifted my left knee slightly. I take a little wiggle to the left. Now, when I go left, my right knee goes up and my left pelvic sticks out and my upper body goes opposite to the pelvic, okay? So don't try to go to the direction of where your pelvic is, always go opposite. So if I'm going left and the right pelvic is out, my upper body is detached, separate. Now I'm going to do a little wiggle again and take it to the right. A little wiggle, left. Wiggle, right, left, okay? Now what's happening is the little wiggle I do in between is actually a shimmy. To get that, you need to make sure your knees are slightly bent, relaxed, and you can shake your hips just slightly. It's literally a one second move, okay? So one, Okay, now, how do I make it more exaggerated? I lift the knee at the point where the pelvic bone is inside, okay? See now, that pelvic bone is inside, the knee is up, I'm on my toe, okay? Wiggle again, boom. Right knee up, pelvic in, opposite pelvic out. This is the bone that I'm playing with, okay? I'm not playing with my hip bones at all. This is my focus right here. So I want it out as much as possible. See that? The bone is out. I've got my upper body on the other side. I've pushed it to the other side. The knee is out. Again, this is out. Opposite knee is out. Pelvic here is in. Body is out. So shift, shift, shift shift okay that's exactly what i need to see it could look like this that's boring we want it to look like right to be a little more cute and graceful all right so let's try it kusu 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 tera suku 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 nahi mera nahi mera okay how do we do that while we're doing this Okay, all we have to do is twist our hip out and in, okay? So make sure it's not just looking out and back in, it comes with a twist, okay? Twist the hip, look out, and come back for the hook step again, cool? So it will look like this, suku, 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 right? We're going to twist it, nehi. Mera, okay? So look when you hit the nahi, look away. So nahi, mera, cool? Again, five, six, seven, eight, suku, 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 nahi, mera, cool? And we come back here for the hook step again. Gets repeated a second time. All right, let's go now. I'm gonna break it down even slower, okay? So here is the focus for you guys. Now, kusu, kusu happens right here, okay? Bring it in, release. Bring it in, contract that belly in, bring that pelvic forward, release, okay? In, roll it, release. In, roll it, release. In, roll it, release. Okay, so that's exactly what kusu kusu is gonna look right, right here, all right? Again, five, six, seven, eight, kusu, 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 kusu. Then we're gonna hit it with the tera. Okay? Notice I'm gonna give it to you more slowly, alright? From here, we did the last kusu and we brought 
this hip out, swing the other one from back to front into position. From here, we're going to pull it right crosses while that hip comes out, comes down, the other arm crosses, the left arm crosses into position. All right, let's go slower, okay? Five, six, seven, eight. Boom. Five, six, seven, and kusu, 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 tera. Boom, all right? That's exactly what you need to be doing. Now, once this is done and you're right into position, this is what's happening with your pelvic bone because now we're going to work with the pelvic bone. So imagine you're right here, you're still, okay? You've brought that hip back. Okay, for that, remember, your knees need to be bent. That's what's going to help you move, okay? You brought that hip back, the right one. Now you've swung the left one forward. This comes in. Now, in order for this to come in, this bone, this bone for me, it's bone and fat. <laughs> you need the left leg to be on its toe, okay? And you need to bend it. So this all happens together. Now watch my body slowly, okay? Swirling the hips, the left one is coming forward, I'm lifting. Did you see that? Lifting! <laughs> That's because the toes were up, the knees are bent. That's what needs to happen. This will require some practice, okay? The next move is going to look like this. Now pay attention to what's happening right now to my pelvic bone, okay? This is already inside, okay? And I'm going to do a little wiggle. I'm going to bring this back in, okay? This is out. See that? It's exactly what's happening. Now I'm shaking out, shaking out, I'm really pushing that pelvic bone out and I'm pushing my upper body in the opposite direction, okay? So one, two, three. Now don't forget, for my pelvic bone to be inserted back in, that knee and the toes are helping me do that, okay? Bending that knee on my tippy toe. So I keep exchanging that movement, okay? Keeps happening. So don't get your hip bone out. It's, this is not the move, okay? Keep it literally where it's supposed to be, always, and just focus on this movement, okay? And once this movement happens, the other opposite direction goes out, and I'm pushing my upper body opposite at all times, okay? Opposite, out. Opposite, out. Cool? So I'm going to give it to you slowly. Five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Cool? Yay! I think you guys did it. All right, so let's move forward now. All right, now let's finish this part off because there's a second part of the hook step we haven't even reached yet, okay? So we go suku, 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 nehi, mera. Okay, now I'm back here. I've got my hands right here, right? Not in the hair, not back, right here, okay? And we're going to go and roll that stomach again. Kusu, kusu, double, double, one more. Tera, okay? Again, hit it with the suku, 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 okay? Now, right here, it's nehimera, okay? Now, what do we do at nehimera? We're going to shimmy. Once we shimmy, right, get the hold of the shimmy. This is exactly what the shimmy is going to look like. Both the knees are slightly bent, okay? And I'm focusing on these hips, focusing on moving them. Now, that jiggle needs to escalate into the stomach. Now, what am I going to do exactly? Now, while I'm shimmying, I'm going to give you that undulation, okay? Now, why do I want that undulation? Because when I club both the moves together, the shimmy with the undulation, I'm going to come up to my chest. Now, once I come up with my chest, okay, shimmy undulate, chest is here. This is when I'm going to tighten my stomach, okay? There's a sound like that in the song, okay? You're going to hear it, okay? So it's okay? Right on that, I need the precise, sharp. We're going to break it down one more time. We're going to move on, all right? So right when we go 
da 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 na 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 te ra again 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 nehi me ra again again da na 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 pull it back up just one two shimmy with the undulation and in okay sideways would look like this when i'm shimmying shimmy with the undulation and then squeeze in that stomach okay all right guys now let's move on so after i shimmy undulate contract i'm going to come up immediately okay and my rotation is going to be like this now notice while i rotate my arms are not moving at all that's the beauty of this movement because what the vocal point of this is going to be again the same stomach roll we did for kusu kusu it's going to happen here but we're going to add the movement of our bum okay so our bum is going to shift literally in a circular motion okay so sideways what's going to happen with this is you're going to literally shimmy it shake it like this but i want you to think of like a circle and you're trying to like move in that circle okay get that bum jiggling okay girls now when you get on your toes and you travel okay again this is without the bum and the stomach movement we're just going to travel so that you get a hang of the rotation now what's going to happen is i'm going to start doing this so what's going on here guys my stomach is rolling really fast okay but at the same time so is my bum so the side will look like this okay now what's working here my pelvic is working because it's going in out like i did with kusu kusu step but faster my stomach literally the center of my belly is like moving 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 you need to control those muscles at the same time this part of my lower back is moving okay this is a move we call winding okay but when we do it really fast it looks like this so slowly this is the movement in releasing out in see that releasing out fast looks like that okay so my back my lower back is working my pelvic is working my lower abdomen is working my center of my stomach is working and my toes are working because i'm up here okay so the move will look like this okay slowly will look like this You got that? See the beauty of this whole movement is that nothing else in the body is moving. The chest is still, the shoulders are still. It's literally just this and the bum. Okay? So let's do that. Ready? This comes in the second kusu kusu. Let's try this. All right, take it from nehi mera ta come up. Kusu 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 kusu. We're here to go down on tera. Okay? That's another move which I'm going to teach you right when you get this move correct. All right, let's do it again. Nehi mera tak up kusu 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 tera. Okay, so get ready to go down on the position. Down on literally your knees are going to be bent and you're on your toes. Okay. Now once this is done, we're in this position. We're sort of diagonal. We're going to take the Tera position, okay, which is literally right here and on set during the shoot. I think I fell a thousand <laughs> times. This one requires strong knees and strong quads, as we call the Megan knees. All right, so follow me. Five, six, seven, eight. Nehi mera tak kusu 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 tera. Okay, tera. Now suku suku. Okay, so what's happening here? <laughs> We are literally when we come down here, we lift ourselves and we shimmy. Now, how do we shimmy? We shake our knees like this and we tippy toe. Okay, I don't know if you can see my toes, but there's a little happening. Okay, now it hurts the knees, but we gotta do it. Okay, so once we come from here, we're gonna go tera suku suku nehi mera. Okay, after that. We repeat the kusu 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 move. Now what happens is when I'm down and I lift myself up for the shimmy, a lot of things are moving: the knees, the thighs, and the hips. Okay, hands will be here. You come up, come up, come up, and position. 
Go back into your toes, okay? All right, guys, now you've come up from the floor, from your position of suku, 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 nahi, mera, right? Back again on your toes. We're going to catch again one more. Kusu, 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 kusu. Okay, we're here. Now, what's going to happen is we're going to move forward. It's a couple of steps. We're still in our position right here. We're still on our toes. But what's going to happen is we're going to switch the focus from our belly and our bum and hip area. And we're going to go back to our pelvic bone. Remember the bone we played with during suku suku? So that's what we're going to use now. But we're going to drop it. Okay, so what I need you guys to do is this bone right here, if you can see it, okay, I want it to go down. The other one goes down. The other one goes down. Okay, nothing is moving except this bone. Okay, now channel your energy, tie it into that, and drop. Okay, drop the other one, drop the other one, and that's what's going to happen when we're in this position. We're going to go one, two, three. Okay, now what's happening? My toes is moving forward. One, two, three. Now every step I take, that hip bone is dropping. Now, if I go on the right, I'm taking the step on my right leg. This is dropping. The left leg goes forward. This is dropping. Right goes forward. This is dropping. Nothing else moves except this. These two bones, all right? So let's do that now. We went final kusu kusu, final one. Okay, then we go tak, tak, tak. Okay? It's, for me, I think this is my favorite move because it's so cute, it's so intricate, but it's so feminine, graceful at the same time, okay? So we're here, we don't change our position, we rotate, rotate, we're on our toes, we're still on our toes, our arms are still in position, we drop, 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 okay? And we take the nehimera, the last nehimera, which drags, we're going to take it with a shimmy, now we're back on our flat feet, okay? And we're going to take the shimmy again. And as we did in the first shimmy, we're going to undulate, okay? This undulation of the stomach, you can call it a roll, whatever you want, is stronger than the first one. And this shimmy is also stronger than the first one. Because the impact, if you hear the way she sings and the impact of the music, it requires a bigger move, okay? So it's more grand. Our arms are open and we shimmy and we roll up. So the roll starts here in my lower abdomen, my lower stomach, okay? I lift it in, I roll, I bring it to the chest, and then I carry it on from my neck to my face. And that's the last thing I look up, okay? And I try to do the shimmy at the same time. So don't stop the shimmy just because you're doing the roll. Try to do it at the same time. That's the beauty of this move. If you just do it like this, that's easy, anyone can do that, right? But I'm not trying to do moves that anybody can do, right? Only cool people can do these moves. So that's why I clubbed the shimmy with the undulation at the same time. Now, when you're undulating, your shimmy will slightly reduce, but don't worry, you just keep those knees moving. Back and forth, back and forth, flat foot, right on the ground, okay? Shimmy, 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 undulate, look up, okay? That's your last move, and this whole sequence is over, okay? Let's do that again. So we were, we were down, right? We went suku, 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 suku. We came up, nehi, mera, okay? Then we took the last kusu, 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 tera, suku, suku, nehi, mera. Cool? Now, when you're doing these moves, there's a vibe to it that I need you guys to capture. So, kusu kusu kusur. It's a short form for kusur, right? Kusu 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 tera. Suku 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 nehi mera. Sukun. So when you're saying kusur kusur, okay, in your head, you're holding your head like that, you're singing to that guy, you're like kusu 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 tera. It's because of you, all right? I can't sleep at night because I keep thinking about you, right? That's the feeling I want, okay? And even when we hit the suku, suku, you know, you're, you're looking away, you're looking here, you're holding your head, you don't have peace. But it's like, 
low key is a good thing. It's not really a bad thing because you know you're so in love and you love that guy. So it's like you don't even know how to feel about this, right? And even when we do the nehi mera, so you notice like there's a cuteness in the face, there's a femininity in the face, there's nothing harsh about the expression, there's nothing, um, you know, just in your face. It's all beauty, it's all, you know, feminine, and you're just trying to tell people, guys, look at me, I'm in love, I'm crazy in love, I'm restless, and that is why a lot of shimmies happen in the song because there's a lot of explosion in the music and even the feelings are explosive. So that's the interpretation of the song. So when you do your moves, feel it, feel it, feel it, feel it. It's not about, oh, look, I can do a belly roll or look, I can isolate my hips. It's not about that. It's about the beauty, the art of it all, the motion, the feeling, the poetry. All right? Even when we're here and we take this move, the face has to have a very nice softness to it, okay? And when we drop our pelvic bone, suku suku, nehi mera, okay? This nehi mera, even the face has to be like, oh, you know that you got me like, you got me hooked, or you know you got me whipped and I got no peace, but I love it, okay? So that's the vibe that I guys want you guys to capture when you're dancing to this song, okay? Now, I'm gonna, club it all together for one last time and if you want me you want to see me dance to this hon music you can click on the link below okay so let's do this one more last time you ready five six seven eight kusu 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 tera suku 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 nehi mera kusu 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 tera suku suku nehi mera ah Kusu 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 tera suku 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 nehi mera kusu 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 tera suku suku nehi mera. Woo! Okay, I'm out of breath. That was crazy. That's exactly what the hook step looks like. Now, guys, learn it, rewind, watch it on slow motion, but please execute it as good as you can. Remember, the beauty is in the intricate, intricate part of the moves. The beauty is in exact details of the moves. Don't try to move every part of your body. Just be graceful about it. All right, guys, enjoy. I'm out of breath. I bet you are too. Have some water. And go on the link below if you want to see me do it on the music. Thank you for watching, guys. I hope you enjoyed my tutorial for the hook step of Kusu Kusu, my new song. Please do dance on it. Show me what you guys got. Do the hook step. Tag me. Hashtag dance with Nora. Hashtag Kusu Kusu challenge. And I will be reposting and sharing your videos. I love you guys so much. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Like, comment, share this video. And learn with me. Love you guys.